Well, Mayor Lisa Salka has been Bluffton's mayor for a long time, but now she is retiring, and they just recently sent her off with a reception. Lisa Richardson takes a look. We're here to celebrate Mayor Lisa Solka in her outgoing term as mayor, but we've got the brand new mayor of Bluffton, certainly not new to Bluffton, lifelong uh, Bluftonian and former town council member. Congratulations, by the way. Well, thank you. Thank you. I know you're here to celebrate Lisa. Why don't right. you share a few reflections about your time working together with her over the years? Well, I've, I've known Lisa even long before I started serving on the council, you know, which has been 10 years now, and we've been friends probably 30, 25, 30 years or more. So she's done an amazing job. This is not a easy task. And first of all, you will never make everyone happy no matter what decision you make. So she's, she's done a great job in her leadership. She's taught me a lot. Um, and I think I've taught her some things, but it's been a total pleasure. Um, she's a workaholic, she's everywhere much more everywhere than I'm planning on being. I'll be where I have to be and when it's important, I'll be there. I'll never leave, but I will never be able to, to go to nine meetings a day and still work <laughs> and make a living and take care of my family. Well, we know that you're gonna pull your heart and soul into Bluffton because it's, it's part it's of It's already you. there. Absolutely, <laughs> so we look forward to getting to know you and sure. talking with you over the next couple of years. So thanks for sharing sure. with us today. It's my pleasure. Feel free to call me at any time. We will. Thanks. We're here with Paige. She is a senior at Cross School, actually the first graduating class to come out of Cross School. That's pretty cool right there. Yes, ma'am. But you're here today. You wanted to come and celebrate, as you said, Mayor Salka, because she's had a special impact on you. Tell us about that. Yeah, so um, when I was a freshman, um, our school had a meeting at the Corner Perk, and Mayor Solka came over to talk to us about the importance of getting involved in our community. And we were only freshmen at the time, so we didn't really understand that, but we all left that feeling very inspired. I know that I did especially. And so I continued to pursue community service throughout my high school career. And the more and more I did it, the more I fell in love with it. Um, Mayor Solka continued to visit our school continuously. Uh, this wasn't just a one-time thing. She also visited us um, in sophomore and junior year to talk about it and the different opportunities we had in the town to get so involved. And um, I know that ever since then, that the way that I've gotten involved and the other people in my class have gotten involved, it's just become such a special part of us. Yeah. And so I think that really reflects her character and just how much she cares about this town and the people in it. And to mm -hmm. me, that's very inspiring. What a great story. I know that you'll leave, um, graduate with some big plans. What are the plans that you have next? I am committed to College of Charleston and I am planning to major in political science. There you go, right? Yeah. Well, yeah. awesome. Well, thanks for sharing with us, Paige. And best of luck to you as you graduate from Cross and get into college next year. Thank you so much. Mark is joining us now and he is with the Town Public Works. He was given a very special secret assignment to do in honor of Mayor Lisa. Mark, tell us what it was. It was to build a bench. And my supervisor approached me, gave me a little sketch and said, Mark, go build this. And so that's what we did. He didn't tell you who it was for, correct? That's not at first, but as I was going along, he did. Well, you had the honor of surprising her today with that, and she was so touched. Tell everyone where they can go find it and take a look at it. At the right family park. And that's one of Mayor Lisa's favorite spots to be. And, so. it, and it has a plaque with her name on it. And you're going to be part of that special memory forever from time to come. So it, thanks exactly. for doing that. Thank you. And thanks for being a special person to her and sharing with us today. Thank you. Thanks, Lisa, and thanks to everyone else on the show for their insights and contributions today. As always, our production team is behind the scenes to make all of this possible. And of course, we are honored that you have chosen to share a part of your day with us. I'm Betsy McDaniel, and we'll see you for the next WHHI-TV Daily News.